hi guys this is maria from maria's way of life welcome back to this year channel i am excited that you can join me today i just filmed my long-term challenges and i am getting ready to do short-term challenges or what i call my seasonal challenges i am excited we don't have much to cash up from my husband's paycheck this week but we do have leftover money from his previous paycheck and from the wallet. So we will be using this money as well. So for this envelope right here, I am going to count this off and it should be actually $36. And this is what I allotted for my challenges. And then we will be playing again, um, very like unplanned. Uh, challenges and it, it usually like just freaks me out just a little bit but it was fun last time so it should be fine this time as well so let's do this 10 20 25 26 27 28 this money is rough 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 36 so we do have $36 in here and I'm actually going to fulfill what I allotted for this week and then we'll get into this money because that's just how my brain works and let's go ahead and bring in my binder which is this one over here and what I had planned for this week was for this Happy New Year one from Budget Better Life to add $4 to it. So let's take this money out and let's take out her cute little tracker here. So we're doing four. Let's pull this to the side and do four. I think is this color, I'm not sure. Yay, it sure is. Alrighty then, if this is your first time here, just a little bit about myself. I am married. My husband gets paid weekly. I get paid monthly. I am an elementary school teacher. We have two girls. One is 14 and one is six. 14 year old, um, just turned 14 and my six year old will be turning seven in two weeks and that's exciting. Um, with my husband's paycheck, we are able to play with the money and do variable spendings. With my paycheck, we do all the bills. So let's add four dollars before i forget because lately i've been messing up a lot one two three and four let's count this one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen not bad at all let's put this back in here Alrighty, for Lady Die Saves, Happy New Year, save more in 2024. I did a lot for this one, $3. So we're going to do the word new. Each letter is $1. So I think we did. I don't know. maybe this one oops i dropped the other one so if it was the other one too bad let's go so now we have let's see two four five six seven eight let's see one two three four five six seven eight perfect we will put this like that and put it back in here. For the cookie savings, I did a lot for Budget with Mama Bear, $10, and it is a scratch off here in the back. And we already know we're scratching for next week as well. Let's go ahead and pull out the money for 
this challenge. Alrighty, let's get the 10. Very rough. Very rough. I don't know. <laughs> Alrighty then. Let's put 10 in here. And we have 20, 30, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48. 20, 30, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. 49. I'm going to put it back in here. Some of these bills are just hanging by a thread. <laughs> All right, we're getting closer to our goal of $80. We are more than halfway there, and that's exciting. Let's see what we allot for next week. Let's do this one. Too adorable, that's $7. I am going to write this one down because I will forget. All right. There and then, did I allot anything else? I sure did. Okay, so cookie savings, and now we're going living on a tiny budget. It's right here. How cute is this? I love it. It's very like simple and cute and low denomination. I love it. So I allotted six dollars for this challenge. I'm going to get the gold metallic marker. This is copper. Let's see, where's the gold one? Right here. And let's color in six dollars. Very cool. Five, six. We should have 12, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Perfect. That is very cool. I love the way that's turning out. Very, very neat. All right, for this one right here, this is Mischief Managed Budgets. We are going to add, why am I going there? I'm right here. I'm going to add, what is it? $10. $10. Why? Oh, sorry, 50, 51, 52. Are you okay, baby? Yeah. Okay. She's playing with her magnet tiles. That's the noise you're hearing in the background. Okay, so $52, and we're adding how much did I say? I lost train of thought. $10. Yay, that's good. 10. 11. 12. 13. 14. 15. 16. 17. 18. 19. 20. 21. 22. 23. Awesome. Let's get those cards out. And this was last week. We did one and nine. And I don't know if we're going to do two. We'll just play it by ear and see how much we have here. I'm not in a rush. Yeah. We don't have many to go either, but let's see what we have for next week. All right, that should be eleven dollars. All 
All right, awesome. Love this challenge. And then in this envelope, I added it because I'm doing a no spend challenge. And the envelope is from Reynolds Budgets. The challenge in here is from Budget With Me. Just in case I forget to add it to the description. Budget With Me, am I? And I decided to scratch off and for every two days. So let me explain. Let me go over here first of all. This is a no spend challenge from Two Sister Bees. And the goal here is for me not to do any unbudgeted purchases. And for me, or if obviously I have in a sinking fund, that would not be considered unbudgeted. That means I was prepared because I had a sinking fund, right? Um, to buy no challenges, budget challenges in January and no eating out. So, so far, today is the fifth. We are doing good. Now, let me tell you something about this. I almost, almost bought Strawberry Money Wallet. She finally released the ASICS wallet that I was waiting for. And I was so tempted, so tempted. It is $60 with like tax and shipping is like $72. And you know what? I'm just not going to. I really am not going to. And if I, I, I could have done it. But I think it would be so much more powerful to know that I'm okay without it. I don't know if that makes sense. I don't know if I'm making sense. But... It felt really good when she released it at 8 a.m. Pacific time. And I was like, <gasps> I was at work. And I was like, I, the wallet. Oh, my gosh. The pink one. Will it sell out? Will it be out of stock? Will she bring them back? Like, all of these mental, like, process. You know, I'm like, what is wrong with me? I am fine. I don't need it. So, for next week, so far, we have one, two, three, four, five days following the rules and I've been okay with it. I don't know how I want to do this, but I know for sure I want to scratch off for every two days. So for day one and two of January, it will be this scratch off. And then, so since I'm only doing up to the fifth day, I'm going to do one, two, three, four, and then I'm still scratching this one, but I'll be only allotting half of it, if that makes sense. I'm not sure if that's making sense. Um, because I don't know whether I'm going to keep up with this. And the hope, obviously, is that I will. But I want to include other challenges. And not to make it hard on myself, but this is what I was thinking. I was just going to do $1 per day. But I was like, I literally, the wallet was going to be $72. If I was able to hold back, look at how much I can save now. You know, like literally, this would have been my entire challenge. So $1 a day, I don't think it's worth it. I think this should be awesome for me to start saving on me because literally that's what I would do. I will spend money and then I will claim that it's for the budget and this and this and that. But at the end of the day, I want it to be for my self-care. So not that this is not because I love doing this, but I don't know if I'm making sense. Maybe not. Maybe not because I'm tired and it's late. So <laughs> anyway, let's go ahead and scratch off. And see what I'm allotting. I would never like to color in until I have fulfilled a challenge. So let me scratch off and see what's going to happen. I was not going to use. I have all 12 months. I wasn't going to use this. But I think what a perfect way to use this for all 12 months. And this is only enough for 20 days. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. For 20 days. Um, so... I can technically choose a different scratch off if I'm able to fulfill these. I don't know if that's making sense, but let's scratch off and stop talking. Blah, blah, blah. Let's do it here.
All right, so we scratched off 17, five, and two. The rest of them are going to be a little bit more scarier, I'm assuming, because it's in a $100 one. So here's what I was talking of, about. This is for day one and two, right? I'm just going to write it in. I should probably have done this day one, two, and three since it's so high, but that's okay. One and two, three and four, and this is five and six, but we're still not on the sixth of the month. So what I'm going to do is a lot 17 plus five plus one. And then next week I'll do the rest equals 23, which in this case is a really low one. So I don't know if am I going to be able to do it. I probably should since I was going to get ready to purchase a $72 wallet, right? So $22 going in and the no spend challenge next week. I hope that makes sense. And I thought that this would be a cool thing to do since, I mean, this week my justification for saving so much or this much, not so much is the fact that I was going to spend so much on a wallet. So I'm going to put 23 for no spend next week and then we'll take on from day six and on. So let's see. Let's hope I don't forget this by the way. So 23, did I say 23? I forgot. Um, 17, I should have put it the other way. Hold on. Seventeen plus five is twenty-two, twenty-three. And I actually had a lot of three dollars for day one, two, and three for this week. So that's not gonna happen. I could technically put three and do twenty next week, but I'm not. I'm just going to throw this in to this envelope and let's play some more right or technically i can really fulfill this right now should i no i don't want to <laughs> sounding like a baby here i want to start in the back because last time i didn't get to some challenges and since i can play with the extra money i'm not even gonna count it look i'm gonna be a rebel i'm just gonna go with it um, I have a lot of dollar bills. So I don't know how far this is going to take me, but however far, it will be fun. Let's go ahead and start with Budget Better Lives Christmas book. And this will be um, the fun for my Christmas. Um, What do you call it? My Christmas. Oh my gosh, I can't think. My Christmas sinking fun for 2024. So we're going to start with this first beautiful page. How adorable is this blue? Like I am all for it. So let's go ahead and scratch off and let's see what we're going to start with. We are not in no rush, but hey, slow and steady will be awesome here. It should give us 1K if nothing else. And if I want to use this for like say Valentine's, then we'll do that. But right now, my goal is to do Christmas. I should probably stick to that. But things always change. We will see. I want to do one more. <laughs> but I'm afraid. Let's go. All right, we're going to go with that. Okay, this is kind of sticking to the laminate, so let me just, I don't like doing that, but that's okay. Oh, how cute. So we have five, six dollars that are going in here to start with. Look at this dollar, man. Somebody washed it. Okay. All right, beautiful challenge, Budget Better Life um, on Etsy. You can find it there. And we started it. Hey, all it takes is to take that first step, right? I'm excited about that. 
Okay, moving on. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Okay, this right here, I have it right next to me. I want to get started with the Budget Princessas Challenge. She's the Budget Princessa Co, I think, on Etsy. I will link her down below. And I'm so excited to do this. And I need some dyes. And this is always so much fun to do. And I think I'll use... Look at me. I want to cheat right away. <laughs> is this too much? Is this too much? I want to know. This goes all the way to 16. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Like, I want to cheat. Let's do that one. Because I want to get through it, you know? So we're going to do that one, hoping that we don't get 16 every time. And then I need um, this right here. And let's go ahead and get started. This is so exciting. All right. So this one is called Straight to the Bank. And uh, you can just, I mean, it's just a, a little game. So you start right here. And then I think these colors denote how much you're going to scratch off under there and to pay up. But let's hope we don't get that. So <laughs> let's go and get started. I'm so excited. Let's do this. And it's seven. Why was I going to grab seven dollars? Oh, my gosh. And I landed on two dollars. One, two. And I want to. Let's do. I don't know. This blue one, maybe. I actually want to skip it next time. I want to see how much it gives me by just fulfilling the whole card. Does that make sense? Let's see. That's a six. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's one dollar. All right. That's a nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's five dollars. Eight. Oh, wait a minute. Well, first of all, yeah, no, I'm not going to survive. Right. Hold on. Give me a so second. I think it was this one. I'm hoping I'm correct trying to fix that let's let that dry and grab five one two three four five ten one two three four five six seven eight nine ten that gives us another five Three, one, two, three. That's three dollars. One, two, three. Two. Wow. <laughs> one, two. Over here. Four. Let's go ahead and do 10 and put back six. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Let's go. Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> I mean, I'm getting the money, right? So that's good. I mean, saving the money, I should say. One. Great. 
One, two, three, four, five. Is this one? No. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. No. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. And that's where I'm going to stop because I started the game again. That is so awesome and it is so much fun. I love it. So that would be $5. And I think I'll just do that one. Yep, I'll do that one. And should I just do... Yeah, let's do two fives and just take the ten. I think I did that right. If I didn't, uh, oh well. So we have 10, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26 going into this challenge. No scratch offs this time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But I was able to do eight of these. Such a cute challenge. I love it. I hope I was in frame all this time. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right. So let's put this in here. It comes with the little envelope. You can choose to get it or not. And we're going to put it in here. Awesome, yay. Okay, good. Now I want to add something to this one, not urgent. So guess what I'm going to do? That's what I'm going to do. And this one is from the Happy Mailbox Co. Lisa Grateful Me here on YouTube. And we're going to get started with it with $1. There we go. How cute is this? I love it. I think I got this one as a freebie when I purchased five of her challenges in December. I want to say that's what happened. I love it, love it, love it. We're going to start hitting this one hard because I think I should do this one for Valentine's. Not for Valentine's, but to fund Valentine's basically. All right. And then here's another Valentine's one talking about Valentine's. And this one is from, not this one. This is nothing. Okay. This one is from Jesse Budgets and it's $45. Very doable, very low budget. And I love her challenges. You will always see me pull one out of one of my binders because I have her all over. So we're going to go ahead. Let's roll the dice because I don't know what to fulfill. Eight. One, two, I was going to grab that. I'm not sure why. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's do three dollars in here. And let's color that in. Love it. So cute. All right. So three dollars going in here. Very cool. And this one, yay, I'm going to be able to pull finally from Champagne's Corner. And now I'm looking around me and I don't see the little box. Hold on. I have it behind me. Found it. <laughs> All right, let's pull one out. You can see I cannot. Let's do this one. I'm not looking, I promise. Whoops. This one. And this one. Okay. Let's see what we got. Oops. Okay. We have an eight, a nine, and a five. I think this one's a six, though. Hold on. Last time I said, I think it's, yep. Yeah. No, that's, I don't know. Hold on. This Hello Kitty is a nine. So that means this is a six. Okay, so I have six, five, eight. Six, five, and eight. Let's write it in because I'll forget. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Six, five, eight. And... Now I'm thinking this is going to be really high. Oh my gosh, I didn't even think about that. Six plus five plus eight equals $19. So this time $19 need to go in here. And I think this is going to be it. Let's see. Five, 10, 11, 12, 
13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Oh my goodness. Wow. So guess what, guys? No shut the box today, but I am excited because I re I've been meaning to get to this challenge for the longest. And I feel really successful. I really want to do one of these challenges. And this was awesome. I have a dollar that, what was next? Oh, perfect. Okay, shut the box was next and we did it last week. So that was perfect. I got to do challenges that I had not done before. And that makes me feel great. I am going to go back here though. Or should I? No, let's go to this one and do another dollar over here. And that way, now we have two into this challenge. Oh my gosh, how exciting is all of this? I had tons and tons of fun playing these challenges. It really feels awesome. I'm not going to lie to you guys. It feels really great. What is this? Okay, I'll fix it there. Uh, to fulfill so many challenges. It was so nice. I have some by Simply Living Saves. I absolutely love her channel as well. And these are like um, holiday theme ones. So I want to get to this one eventually. And I'm just going to do them dollar challenges. So I just left them here as a reminder. Very nice. Let's go through this. We were able to fulfill this one. This one. Cookie Savings. 2024 the nativity um this one will be into next week and we started from the back so these didn't get a chance but that's okay because they were loved last week then we were able to do champagne's corner jesse budgets the happy mailbox co the budget princessa and Budget Better Life. Absolutely love it and am thrilled about this. That is so exciting. All right. I think that's all I have for now. I'm hoping I'm, I'm not forgetting anything. I think we're good. This felt amazing. And you guys keep having an amazing Sunday when you're watching this. Or whenever you're watching it. And I'll see you next week with week two of my husband's paycheck and week two of the year and let's see what i will be able to fulfill next week it whatever it is we are going to be happy about it and we are going to make the best of it thank you so much for being there for your comments for your support for all the love before i let you go i do want to give a shout out to shirley 5909 here on YouTube, Listen Less, Planning with Chloe, The Budget Princessa, for your amazing comments this morning. They pumped me. I uh, My demeanor changed immediately at work. I was tired because I didn't sleep well. And honestly, it made me just push through the day. And you guys don't understand how amazing it felt to read your comments as the notifications were coming through during the day in the classroom. Thank you so very much. You made my Friday. You made my day. And thank you. I appreciate you so very much. God bless each one of you. Thank you. Shout out to you girls. God bless you always. Bye.